number of public schools are shutting down over health concerns. Everett schools are closing until the end of April. Wellesley and Medford schools are shutting down for two weeks. Tonight, Boston Public Schools remain open. Nick Emmons is in Everett, where parents are now trying to figure out child care for the next 30 days. Yeah, one by one, we saw schools cancel classes all over fears of coronavirus, but now it's putting parents in a tight spot. Another day, another wave of school closures. In Medford, public schools will close for two weeks. This is my first eight weeks on the job, and I never in a million years would expect this and to have to deal with a pandemic. Medford Mayor Brianna Lungo Kern says the decision was not an easy one, especially because so many families rely on the schools. One big issue we're concerned about is food insecurity and those students who depend on our schools for one to two meals a day, five days a week. Everett went further and canceled classes for the next month. The closures, while done as a precaution, leave many parents in a difficult spot. What to do about child care and work? Not sure how we're going to rearrange life. Uh, his mother and I both have to work full time. David Bentley's nine year old son, Hatcher, goes to school in Somerville. He'll be home for at least two weeks. And just hope that it doesn't extend more than the two weeks. Yeah. You know? yeah, what, I mean, what would you do at that point? So, that's a great question. Yvonne Jardim has three kids and now worries about paying the bills if she has to stay home. I'm not going to be paid if I'm not going to work. So it's, and then at the end of the month, we have to have money to pay the bills. While we saw many schools deciding to cancel classes today, Boston Public Schools will remain open with the exception of one in the North End. In Medford, I'm Nick Emmons, WBZ News.